This is my 1976 Ford F-150 two-wheel drive. I'm fixing to put on Craigslist here in Oklahoma. This truck has a 302. Um, has an AOD four-speed automatic transmission. This gets pretty good gas mileage. Uh, the body's in real good shape. Got one spot right here on the bed that needs to be cut out. I was going to just cut it out right here, weld in a new piece, and uh, replace that panel. Interior's in pretty good shape. I've got an, another set of doors for this truck. Same year, 1976. The reason why I want to replace them is there's a little bit of a crease in a few places, and the bushings could use it. Um, this truck is daily driven. As you can see, it's, it's dirty. I use this every day. Has Flowmaster's uh, 9 inch Ford rear end, uh, limited slip. I'm listing it um, on Craigslist for 3000 or best offer. Here's the other door, you can see this. I also have a brand new set of grill inserts that'll go with the truck. They're still in the box, I haven't put them in yet. This truck needs a master cylinder, I have a brand new one, I haven't put it in yet. This one, uh, uh, I guess it leaks a little bit. Um, truck runs really good. Let's start it up now. Flowmasters come back. Stop right there, just right before the rear axle. truck is what it is. You see the brake light on? That's from the master cylinder. Motor runs real good. Probably use just this minor bit of a tune-up. I've got a set of uh, wire harness strips up there in the dash. I haven't installed yet. Um, I don't want to do too much to the truck. The more I do to it, the more I want to keep it. So, it is what it is. It's pretty easy. Pretty easy to diagnose work on this truck. There's no electronics other than the electronic ignition for this truck. Uh, starter, everything's in, in great order. I use it every day, but I need a work truck. I need something I can tear up. And uh, I'm, I'm trying to get a welding rig together. I would consider any, uh, any trades. Uh, I'm preferably, look, like I said, I'm looking for a welder, looking for a Lincoln SA200 or another gas-powered water-cooled welder and uh, an old work truck to haul it on. Uh, this would make somebody a fantastic truck. The Blue Book value, the NADA Blue Book value is about $3,200. I value it at the lowest NADA, which is uh, 3000 Fixed up this truck, according to the NADA, is an $11,000 truck. Uh, the short wide beds are hard to come by for this body style. This one's pretty clean. It won't take a whole lot to make this really, really sweet ride for somebody. But 3000 or best offer. You can give me a call. 405-452-3579. Thanks for watching.